The last question is from Ahmed. Ahmed. He's, last question. <laughs> yeah, he, he directed it to you. Uh, uh, <laughs> now, inshallah. Now, he said he missed me in Medina, but I'm <laughs> going to meet him in Copenhagen, inshallah. 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 Uh, answer Ahmed and answer me. I want to know, how can I guarantee success both in this life and in the hereafter? There are many ayat in the Quran which talk about success. Take for innocence, qadi aflah al mu'minun. Right away, people think qadi aflah al mu'minun in the hereafter. While every ayah in the Quran talks about success or falah or najah, it talks about a general success in this life and, and the hereafter as well. So just give us uh, some, you know, tips. If you want to be successful in this life and the hereafter, you have to submit your will to Allah Azza wa Jal. Jal. You have to acknowledge that Allah Azza wa Jal is your creator. He's the giver of life and he is the provider. You have to trust, rely and depend on Allah Azza wa Jal. Mm. And you have to follow the means that Allah has created for you to take. Mm. So you have to work, you have to learn. And above all, you have to cleanse yourself inside and out. Mm. So it's not how you look, it's how you feel, how you believe, how you communicate with others. And you need to surround yourself, and this is extremely important, in this day and era mm. where we live. With a good peer. You need to have good companionship. Mm. Because if you're a lone wolf, and you know that this is a bad terminology to use, if you're a loner, then shaitan is waiting for you is lurking in the dark for you to make a mistake. Hmm. But when you have your brothers in the Islamic center, in the masjid, you hang out with them. They follow really Quran and Sunnah and not hmm. uh, a YouTube and... Yes. Correct. So we, you have to have this. Once you have this environment and you start to learn your religion. Don't mm. be a, f a ball people play with and toss it from one place to the other. Learn your religion, learn your Quran, let the Quran in your heart, always on your mind, always in your tongue. Remember Allah, learn fiqh, mm. know how to pray, how to fast, mm. learn akhlaq, how to deal with your parents and with your neighbors and with your colleagues. You, my friend, will be successful. Allahu Akbar. May Allah grant us all success, Shaykh.